So look, in this video, I'm not going to come on no, we all need to stick together and stop the violence and everybody needs to hold hands stuff. Because the truth is, tribes have been warring forever, right? Tribes have been going at it forever. Way before the Western world. Way before this. There's been many wars, right? But what I will say is, if you can't see that it's a death curse going on right now, so a death curse. Now, Nas Blicky, right, who just got shot yesterday, got shot in the head. Allegedly, that's, that's, that's the story that's how he got shot in the head. I'm seeing some that say he's in critical condition, seeing some stories say he's a vegetable, seeing some stories say, you know, that he's dead. I don't know. Right? I just know he was shot in the head. And I think like two other times. One thing that I noticed about Nas Blicky, right? Let's go to Nick Blicky. When Nick Blicky transitioned after he was murdered, his mother, his beautiful mother, shout out to his mother, beautiful woman. She came out on an interview and she said that that, that that her son was a sacrifice, her son Nick Blicky. Not too long ago, not that long ago, on an interview, Nas pretty much was like, she pretty much said that because she was hurt, right? When a mother gives a, gives a divine message, right? Speaks a divine message. Sometimes we have to shut up. Sometimes we have to shut up because you never want to get in the way of the spirit realm. See, when, when, when people's children tr transition, right, or, or going through that transitional phase, and their mother comes out and speaks, you don't, you don't speak on that. You, you let that be. Just let that be, especially when you was close to the individual and you have a certain amount of influence on how people are going to going to see the situation. Right. So Nas, how I felt about that interview was Nas could have been like, you know, what? Um, I'm not going to speak on that. She got every right to say whatever, however she feel, you know. But. What y'all gotta realize is throughout this music, what I mean by when I say there's a death curse is these rappers that really be gang members, right? The energy that they manifest, they manifest, it's always gonna come back in some way, shape, or form. When you talk about murder all day, you talk about killing all day, all you really doing is getting the oppressor rich, because one of y'all gotta go to the graveyard, right? Who owns the graveyards? One of y'all got to go to prison, right? Who owns the prison? So, y'all sit here and y'all say after police, after government. But y'all constantly helping them to get rich. Y'all constantly helping them to get rich. See, when, when people back in, in the day, right? Whether it was Vikings, whatever, whatever, right? When they came to a land and they took over a land and, and, and invaded... They made sure their people were straight or else they would die trying, right? I'm not saying that was right, but they made sure they did it for their people to make sure their people were straight, to make sure that they could settle in that new land. They weren't just running around killing each other while other people profit off of, off of each other's deaths and then bragging about it. I be seeing dudes, uh, kick, you know, knock over people's um like little memorials and all type of stuff, just pictures and candles, doing things that it's going to come back to you in some way, shape, or form. Y'all think that the spirit realm don't exist. Y'all think that that y'all can just do and say anything and there will be no consequences. But the whole time there's an entity that's looking at you like this. Just like that. Y'all dudes is out here really living scary stories to tell in the dark. Tales of the Crip stories. Right? Or was it Tales in the Hood? Right? Y'all not 
you're not tapped into your, 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 your higher self and your heart. Because you can still be a warrior. You can still be everything that you're try, y'all people, y'all be trying to portray without having to put that type of toxic frequency out there. Because once you're gone, what about the younger ones? What about your, 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 your what about the, your little bros, your little cousins, this and that? You don't care. You just, you just don't care, right? You just don't care, right? What about them? What about a better world for them? I get it. You want to be a demon. You Oh, you caught bodies. What's new? It's a million people that got a body. What's new? Be mindful of the frequency y'all putting out here that y'all speaking. This is why I called Nick Blicky's mother a beautiful woman because she was speaking from, from her heart, right? She was speaking from her heart. She was talking unity. She was talking. To, she could have came bitter. She, she didn't have to. She didn't come bitter. And who knows how painful that is to lose a son like that, right? Who knows? But it's like, I just don't understand how y'all can sit here and say, F the police, F the government, and y'all constantly feeding them, y'all constantly keeping them on top, y'all constantly doing doing, doing your, your enemy's work, your hidden enemy's work. You got beef with somebody? Whatever. Why do you have to? Why do you have to go on and rap about it and speak about the death? Oh, they did that to you. You hurt, right? You hurt. I get it. But do what you do outside of outside of trying to go viral, where you're influencing a bunch of kids. For example, rise, rise in peace to pop smoke, right? But when I first seen that video, um, what was it? What was it welcome to the party? Yeah, it was welcome to the party, right? And I seen kids in the video. And they was dancing around. I'm off the Molly this in the rapping that. I'm like, damn. And then what's gonna stop these kids from popping Molly? From doing drugs? What's gonna stop them? Who's gonna help them when they strung out in the streets? They they end up getting strung out. So who gonna help them? Who gonna come to their aid? Nobody's gonna care. They're gonna look at them like a bum, like a lame. But the whole time, this is going in their subconscious. There's something wrong with that, man. And that energy comes back to you because you're put, we're pushing out, pushing it out to the ethers, and it's coming back to you. Y'all not understanding this yet. Y'all, y'all thinking just the physical, the physical, the physical. Probably worried about what I'm wearing right now. Probably worried about how I'm dre- how I'm dressing, how I'm looking. Instead of getting the message, that's called the zombie. That's called brain dead, a dead people, right? <sighs> Don't think just because somebody looks like they quote unquote lit, right? That they time not coming. Every dog has his day, and we all must answer for our sins, as well as as well as the beautiful things we do. We all gotta sit on that scale. But just know, no matter what, how much of a how much you've gotten away with, how much you think you 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 can you can do, and just know it's gonna come back. It's going to come back. Just be mindful. You can be anything you want. You can own property. You could, you could, you could do whatever you want, right? And I get it. You might have a, might have a mom that's cracked out. You might have came up being abused. You might have came up being molested or raped. I get it. We all know the, the horror stories that people don't speak about too much. But those are your lessons that you're supposed to go through in order to, to evolve. See, fire is transformation. So the, the bigger the fire, the more you get burnt. The more you're supposed to transform, transform, show that you, show that you, you, you're stronger than that. It's going to take work. It's going to take a lifetime of work, a lifetime. I know it ain't going to happen overnight. I know that you have to work every day, but don't leave this body in a state of, 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 of confusion, fear, guilt. Don't do that, please. Don't do that. Do everything you do daily, whether small or big. Is attracting you to a certain timeline that exists of yourself. Get on a timeline that you that you that you want that you really want. Just views aren't success. Just because you get a hundred thousand, a million views with guns and da 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 da, it's a setup, bro. It's a trap. Get out that trap. It's a trap. It's not gonna work in your favor. It's not. But I'm done. Salute, salute, salute. Everybody enjoy your day. And remember, everything you do. <laughs> So we something influencing it.